It's not every day that you find a nearly complete Colombian mammoth skeleton from the end of the last ice age when digging a new parking garage. This tusk is uh, the first complete tusk that we have found here at Rancho La Brea of a Colombian mammoth. Um, it's actually one of a pair. This is the left tusk. Previous mammoth skeletons found here at the La Brea Tar Pits were all jumbled together, so this is truly a huge new find. With this mammoth, it's a single individual, so it is one guy who we call, we call Zed, and we have most of his skeletons, so we're going to be able to recreate, you know, what we know about his life. But Zed is only one specimen of the expected three to four million that will come from deposits discovered during construction of the new parking lot. Excavating the fossils at the discovery site would have taken 20 years. Instead, the excavation team dug around the 16 fossil deposits, boxed them up, and brought them next door to the Page Museum. More than 700 new specimens have already been uncovered. Uh, we've got a saber-toothed cat skull actually right here. It's upside down and you can see one of its sabers poking up right here. Museum visitors are eager to learn more about the new finds. I actually read about it a few days before we came down here, so that was pretty neat that we were coming down here, and then also that was yeah, just bonus. Chief Curator John Harris says the potential for new discoveries is exponential. Then we have the opportunity to have a very detailed picture of how the climate changed and the environment fluctuated during the waning phases of the Ice Age in Southern California. It will take years to fully excavate the 23 boxes behind me, the museum officials plan to have ongoing special exhibits to showcase the new discoveries. We'll learn soon enough just what got trapped in tar thousands of years ago. This is Mark Evett reporting.